time welcoming, baby. KOs for life, you know. I'm looking forward to the challenge. I'm looking forward to, uh, he's an older fighter than I am. He has a little bit more experience in the ring. I know that he knows the opponent that he's up against. Anybody that signs a contract against one time knows what they're up against. So I'm looking forward to the adjustments and all the hard work that he put into his camp and how tough this fight is going to be. You know, um, me and my crew, we're hoping to, uh, to close the show early as usual, but we're definitely prepared to go 12 hard rounds and give you all an exciting fight once again. Well, 31 and 0 with 11 knockouts. So the power doesn't seem like it's at the top, but he did drop his last opponent with a body shot. So there's got to be a little something behind those punch. Uh, eight ounce gloves is nothing to mess with. So I'm still going to protect myself at all times like usual. Um, I call him a little bit of a of a bouncing uh, jackrabbit. Um, he likes to do short steps, very similar to Manny Pacquiao, and he switches from lefty to righty, and he does that most of the time, several times within a round. So I'm looking forward to uh, him changing his style, him being himself. I'm going to be myself, and it should be a great fight. I'm, lo I'm looking at Amir Khan. I'm looking at uh, Marcos Maidana. I'm, I'm looking at the world, man. I, I, would, I would take Manny Pacquiao. I'd fight Timothy Bradley. Anybody that the fans want to see me fight, I am open to negotiating uh, those fights. I am uh, interested in everybody in the top 10 and making a big statement in 2015, we're hashtagging TakeOver.